Hi, Nick here, and I've been using Adobe Premiere Pro uh, Creative Cloud and Camtasia to make my square videos for Facebook and Instagram. And someone, well, actually a couple of people asked me, is it possible to make them in iMovie? And the answer is no. Or is it? You know what's coming. Can you make them in iMovie? No, but there is a way around it, and that's what I'm gonna share with you in this video. So here we are in iMovie, and this is my rectangular uh, canvas that I can't change. So I'm gonna have to download my film of, uh, of me. I was just doing one in front of a green screen. So I'm gonna download that uh, first of all, so we've got that to play with. So once the film's downloaded, I want to go in and open Keynote, um, and I'm gonna basically drag and drop that video right into a blank document, um, a blank uh, presentation slide. So here we go, just done that. And there you go, there's the film sitting in the slide. Now obviously it's still rectangular, but what I want to do is I want to make it all square. So I need to go into, um, let's make it a bit bigger so I know what I'm doing. I want to go into into documents, document, click that document button. And I'm going to change the slide size um, to custom slide size, and I'm going to make that 1024 by 1024, which is a square in my book and anyone else's, I believe. There you go, and up we have it. I'll just uh, make it the right size so we can see. I just need to drag that back across there, lovely. Yes, yeah, so and now you can see that is basically a square, so that would make a great square video for Facebook. So I can then on the top uh, and or the bottom I can type in my text. So uh, Nick's iMovie um, square video hack, and you can muck about with that. You can make it uh, bigger, smaller. You can rotate it. Um, go into text here and uh, see if we can't do a bit of bold. Just make it slightly different so it's going to stand out when we. Let me eventually post it. There you go, that bit's, uh, that's bigger. It's a big old hack. Now, once we've done the, the um, titles, we can actually change the background color as well. It doesn't have to be white. I always like to have a different color to make it stand out because, you know, when people are scrolling through, they want you to, we want them to see our video. We can have it different colors. Um, oh, nice yellow. Um, we got that big uh, master. There you go. That's the one. We can have all sorts of colours there. That's great. And just pick one that you like. One that's going to stand out from the crowd, or even your your corporate colours. But I think for this one we'll have it yellow, so no one can miss us. So once we've done that, we're going to file and we're going to export it as uh, into QuickTime. So this will export it into an MP4 video. So uh, leave all that as it is, apart from format. I always like to have it as high def as we can, so 1080, that's great, hit next, and it's going to ask us to save, so we just save it obviously, export it into download, there we go, export, and now this will uh, now download, there you go, that's our video, that's it in iMovie, well not iMovie, sorry, in QuickTime. And there you have it. There's how we have our iMovie Square video hack. As always, hope you found that informative and helpful. And if you've got any other questions, leave them in the comments below and we'll see whether we can answer them. Take care.